I'm a loner introvert. I'm barely a family member at this point, y'all. For real, y'all, I'm that family member that show up out the blue, and you ain't seen me in five or ten years. I just show up acting normal like I just saw y'all yesterday. One more chance. Three, four, five, six for you. Because I love but you. But how many chances did he have? But it does. He's one of the, like. You're saying he should have been a flagship show. You're because... making a bunch of money, so make sure chance is good. He Got helped it. you. So you're saying that show should have lived on because. Out of respect. Hey, what's going on, everybody? January Flowers here, your favorite homegirl. And today we're jumping into the world of Zeus Network, honey, by way of one more chance. Yes. If you are new to the channel, welcome. And if you are returning to the channel, welcome back, poo. Like the video, share the video, and, and subscribe if you have not already subscribed to the channel and joined the garden. This is going to be some interesting tea because typically out of Zeus, we get the tea from the females, typically. But it looks like there's a male bucking up. And this is someone who has tried to give us tea time and time again. I want to give a shout out to Stevie for supplying me with this in the garden. Let's get into this tea. Now, we all have been speculating and wondering, is Chance getting a season three? Well, after this tea he spilled, he's either going to get it or he's getting the boot. Because it looks like Chance is letting it be known that there's something going on behind the scenes at Zeus. Now, we've known this for years now, but Zeus has silenced a lot of the girls. The tea has dried up. As you can see, the baddie section of the garden, it looks like those flowers are depleted. But it looks like Chance is coming through to unzip and feed the baddie's garden because he's letting it be known that there's a lot still going on behind the scenes now chance released this all via ig insta story posts shout out to stevie for grabbing most of these and i want to give a shout out to reality tv blogspot who grabbed a few pages that disappeared let's get into this tea now the ones we're going to start with are the ones on Chance's page, okay? I'm just going to read them off to you, and I'm going to read these first just in case he, you know, wants to go delete some tea. So we're going to get this tea first. Now, from what I know about One More Chance, it was a, a, an elimination show. Chance is someone who's been looking for love since I was in elementary school. He still ain't got nobody on his arm. But this show was supposed to be, I guess, a resurgence for him. But according to Chance... He wasn't able to eliminate certain girls. Oh, let's just get straight into it. Now, we're going to go to Chance's story. And we're going to get into his tea. Now, some of the bits and pieces are gone. But I, I hope we can find those bits and pieces. Shout out to Stevie who said Chance is exposing Lemmy and Zeus. This is a mess. Let's get into it. You can see this starts with the post with Lemmy and Diddy. Going into this, they really hated me after I turned down Nick Cannon's silly show. They wanted a chance to do an episode, remember? Oh, well, that wasn't a good show or a good look for the Stallionaires. Wanted me to be a part of a flop. Facts. I ain't mad at you, Chance. You speaking clean facts. Chance said they slept with half of my cast. Means it was terrible. Season one and season two. Now let's let's confirm. Remember, um, Sharice Mills, aka Bad and the Bougie, said that after they filmed Chance, she would have to cross the street and go in the house with Lemmy and Janisha. Lemmy and Nisha. This is all alleged tea, but according to her, you know what I'm saying? They was yeah yeah. You know what I'm saying? It was yeah yeah. So they would film with Chance kissing all on Chance handling Chance. Then go across the street, swapping fluids. Yes, get into this D. The girls been saying it. They getting handled behind the scenes. Chance said, then they told me I can't eliminate the girls they slept with. So they could continue having their fun for the whole season through. Told y'all. <laughs> to ooh, ooh, it's crazy how I knew this without even being there. He said, can't get all this out of my head. This is blanking me. Oh, my goodness. Uh, Chance been living with these secrets. Chance said, no artist or entertainment should have to go through what I went through with this company. This kind of treatment has to be stopped now. I didn't want to say anything because they claim to be a black company, but the spirit told me to speak my truth. Go off, Chance. You know what? Well, keep going off. I ain't going to say the garden got your back yet, but keep going off. Chance said, I'm glad you all were here to witness this. God's going to make my way. I know that's right. Oh, 
Ooh, I ain't know they spent the holidays together. Ch what's tea? This what Chance said. That's why Cheeks lost her mind on a reunion. I remember that. She was the first Scotty. I remember Sister Cheeks because um Cheeks and Grandmama was going at it real bad at the good union. But from the show to the reunion, it was a difference. For those who don't remember, I'll add photos because it's worth adding. Like it's, it's worth. During her season, I believe her and Grandmama got into it. Maybe episode one or two. I mean, she was like a floater throughout the show, but, you know, no rememberable lines. For me, no rememberable looks. But when it came to her good union, this is where um, Cheeks kind of showed off. And a lot of people said it seemed overly chaotic. Uh-huh. He said, I felt bad because I knew her before the show. And I thought she would be a good cast member so I can get to know her better. But unfortunately, she got influenced by Lemmy. And I had to witness her losing her mind after all the affairs with the Zeus head person. I'm telling y'all. And it's no shade. But even people who remember that good union, she was given looped queen. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm-mm-mm. He said they tried to make the woman look crazy, but she's really not. They did a great job. You know, the editing, great job. You know, somebody said, oh, this Chance. He said, let's talk about it. I got time, and that's every day. Chance, what you doing? Child, Chance said he ready spilled tea. Chance, you going to come to the channel? Chance said, people ask me why I cut all my hair off. I did wonder. Well, I cut it because Zeus caused me so much depression from what I experienced. I took it out on myself and cut all my hair in one day. Looking in the mirror after that incident, my spirit was broken. I've been disappointed for taking that out on myself. Oh, I had moments like that too, Chance. Chance said, the more I speak, the more my soul feels relieved. I have to speak on this for my own health. That is true. Get it about you. What else happened? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> To be continued, Chance, just come to the garden. Holler at your home, girl, you know? To be continued. Oh, wait a minute. I got to cancel Zeus without the stallionaires. That wouldn't be a network. That's so true. That's too true. Dang. Once again, shout out to Stevie. Ciao. Shout out to Stevie. We got to get into this, Stevie. Now, I told y'all some of the um, posts are gone. I don't know if they were deleted. I don't know. But this is what we got to talk about. The deleted post, okay? Listen. Shout out to Reality TV Blogspot. They said Chance has some words for Zeus. Lemmy, Jocelyn, Natalie, and more. When I tell y'all Chance not playing, he's involved the original, um, what it called her, the Snow Queen, and he's including the chin. So, uh -huh, let's get into it. This first one says, the story about the One More Chance show is a joke. Wait till y'all hear what's going on while I was trying to film. I couldn't find love because everyone was sleeping with the girls the whole time behind my back. Oh, it's a story. Oh, he said, the only reason Lemmy unfollowed me, because he knows I'm right. We just getting started. That's why I keep all text messages. That's what I'm talking about. Weaklings. Yes, Chance. Chance, and I know you're an Aries male. I'm going to give a shout out to you for that. I recently received text and audio clips from people I thought was my friends too, Chance. They phony. Mm-hmm. What's this next one? He said, when Lemmy and Diddy started hanging out, it all started to make sense to me. See what I'm saying? It's becoming too much. Chance, what's going on? Oh, he oh he read and reading. Oh, he read and read. And this one say, I wish I never met these let these two fake A ladies on my show. Can't wait to tell my story. Never forget. Ooh. Ooh. He said, if I didn't do one more chance, that wouldn't have been no budget for y'all chose. Y'all sure did get money from the Zeus Network shaking my they use Chance money, his budget. They use Chance budget to make their shows. I remember Natalie saying that the other day, that the money Baddies Caribbean making is going to Jocelyn's show. That's why Zeus only can film one show at a time. The last one says, still waiting on my Bentley, Lemmy. Promise me for blowing up his network. 
LOL, that's okay. Watch what God do. Chance, don't worry about no Bentley coupe because you're going to get way more than that. Keep spilling tea. Mm hmm. I want to see what people are saying in the comments. This is too much. So it looks like we got some people in the comments. We got Curtis saying at Chance 100, the girl risky business, saying she hate that for him. Somebody else saying Chance was basically the blueprint for Zeus, period. They said Ray J is trying to tell y'all it's the men bucking up. It's the men bucking back for me. You know what I'm saying? Honey said, wow, there's some deep, dark secrets going on. And it's just a matter of time before they all come out. They said, I've been waiting for this. Survivor Suits, it's a Netflix special. Make it happen. Purr. Someone said, man, Jonisha, yo, in out here, talents in the broads. <laughs> Savage, save it. From what Cherie said, Miss Millie. Janisha's in the room with him. You got to understand that she's standing right next to him. Y'all better not think homegirl ain't know what was going on. Y'all will drag her and bring her to the table as well. Someone else said, child, this a little sassy. Somebody else said, beat his chance. And the last one, they said, we want one more chance. Ah, they a trap. But um, let's talk about it. Because this stuff, we could just leave it here. We can, you know, laugh and this and that. But at the end of the day, he's speaking his truth. And at the end of the day, I noticed it. I noticed the change in that young lady, but she was never around again. So, you know, we moved on. The video I did the other day on Scotty, when I said look at her from her season one up until now, and we saw an energy of change. Now, of course, Scotty went back. She always goes back, but I wonder what the difference between her and Cheeks was. Cheeks was never allowed to return. Why couldn't she make a salacious return on baddies or, you know, this and that? Because once Christina left, Scotty came in. Christina was letting us know what was happening behind the scenes with her when Natalie closed that door, allegedly. Stood in front of the door, allegedly. Whispered to her, allegedly, and said, you know what needs to be done, allegedly. The moment Tina was left at the airport, allegedly, they made a, a joke about that. We see Scotty. Natalie's intro to her is that she's the queen of the South. Interesting. Season two of Jocelyn's Cabaret was a cash prize. Since then, it hasn't been a cash prize. Chanel was brought back only to be humiliated. Lexi Blow brought back only to be humiliated. Wet Wet brought back only to be humiliated. I'm not understanding. What's going on, Zeus? Are you really producing stars? Are you just making wicked content? What's going on behind the scenes? What's that veil? Because I believe Chance is speaking truth. He not to say that he's a mascot for change. Because we know Chance got a loose mouth. We know he's, you know what I'm saying. That mouth is a faucet, if you will. He's disrespected women and men equally so. You know what I'm saying? But the thing is, it doesn't take away what he experienced and what he knows. When he was on that Now Net TV special and when Christina was talking to Rocky about what happened on Zeus, Chance was her backup. Chance saw something. Now, the interesting thing is, I don't know if Lemmy will have a change of heart that these stories are coming out or anything like that. I don't know. What Chance knows about Jocelyn and Natalie, I'll stay close to the keys. But we know that these ladies are up to something. You aren't choosing reality stars with integrity no shade the next one up is a erica mina as if the community chose her to be the next one up you know what i'm saying it's not making sense for me and i know everybody's like well you know jan they got the auntie show that's a cloak you guys have to understand certain things that auntie show is a cloak it's something coming from behind the scenes. They're just trying to give the alluder that, oh, we're trying something different. You got to understand. It's most likely no one on that auntie show being used. You see what I'm saying? They're going to produce uh, this Erica Mina, this Jocelyn, even with the um, baddies of the Caribbean Sea. When J.O. was like, why are we just sitting in these rooms? Why they keep bringing us around? J.O. said, I'm going home. J.O. was real vocal. And we all been wondering why is it over 60 women on this show, but we only see eight or nine every week? But allegedly, they're still there. What were they doing, Zeus? Mm -hmm. I'm going to keep my eyes on the case because right now it's just speculation to you. But I do want to hear your thoughts below. Please comment. I mean, as simple as this. Do you believe Chance? 
or do you believe he wants that check? Because one thing he keeps bringing up is this car. Now, Chance, I mean, it is a lure. You know what I'm saying? One of the comments that said it was giving, you know, a lure. Hey, hey. Because you looking for your car. Now, at the end of the day, it is the principal. You know where my car at. But I see what they saying. Like, Chance, sometimes, you you know, you might got to get your own car. You know what I'm saying? But I feel you. Somebody said they was going to do it. But, you know, he's a liar. You know what I'm saying? If you know this man prefers... You know, to gift people with cookies, things, you know, don't even expect it. When he told me, you know, like, let's say I was Chance. If Lemmy came to me and said, I'm going to gift you a car for, for turning the network up, I would have said, sure, but I wouldn't have looked for it. If you know he only gifts the cookies, Scotty, Razor, Cherise, he only gifts the people with cookies. You know what I'm saying? So, allegedly, they all mess with him, but... um. Y'all stay locked to the channel. We gonna keep y'all up to date with all the latest tea. Thank you to everyone in the garden who's supporting. Um, what do you think? What do you think Chance could say that would really like shake the table about Jocelyn? I don't know. That girl has done A to Z. And with Natalie, well, it's a lot of things that can be done with her. Because unlike Jocelyn, who tends to be a little bit more open with her salacious activities, there's something about the nun that tries to keep her veil sealed tight. But whatever chance, whatever you know, make sure that it's able to um, break through a titanium chin. Because I don't know, you know, she's not easily shaken. She's not easily stirred. So make sure that it's a clean sweep. You see what I'm saying? You got to clean up. But y'all comment below. Stay locked to the channel. And also when it came to Cheeks, when he brought Cheeks up, did you guys notice that as well? I should have did this on live, but... I got to go to work later. Listen, y'all got to let me know if you notice that difference with Cheeks. Do you believe Chance? And if y'all can think, what do you think he would know about Jocelyn and Natalie that could disrupt the internet? Because mm -hmm. you see, Lemmy ain't, ain't missing no meals, ain't skipping a beat. You know what I'm saying? He's still going on. They still giving up the cookie. But y'all comment below. <laughs> Let me know how y'all feel about this tea. And do you think this network will change the way more and more of these stories are coming out? Do you see Lemmy just having a change of heart? I don't know. But what I do know is that I want you to remember this. Do the best you can with what you got. And I will see you on my next video. Bye.